the rapid response chest rig by US Grunt Gear. Let's check it out. U.S. Grunt Gear has been making high quality gear for a number of years. It's a veteran owned company. In fact, uh, Robert was a U.S. Marine. Um, he does really handcrafted, uh, special custom stuff originally, and now he's putting out a whole line of different chest rigs, pouches. In fact, the Infidel War Belt is one of my favorite battle belts. Uh, it's just super high quality. And it's done in a fairly small shop down in Miami, Florida. Everything is made right in the USA, and it's just top notch. And we're going to take a look at a lot of the different features of this little rapid response chest rig. Now this was originally made for the SIG MPX. Uh, I didn't have a SIG MPX, but I have the CZ EVO 3 9mm. And the great thing is these magazines fit perfectly in this chest rig. Now I'm going to go over some of the details of the rig itself, just some close-ups. Uh, but Obviously, you know, the uh, CZ Evo 3 Scorpion mags, but also your MPX mags will work as well. He does make a chest rig that will fit Glock mags or the Colt style AR-15 mags in 9mm. Uh, in fact, those chest rigs run quite a bit less and it's a six round chest rig. So if you have a Glock rifle, one of the AR-15s or, you know, a number of others, you know, you want to check him out because these are really excellent chest rigs. We have four of the Matacore arms, and these are the steel feed lip magazines. In fact, I did a full review on these. Uh, these are excellent uh, if you're looking for good mags for your Scorpion, um, and these are 32 round. Uh, one of the things that he does here, of course, he has the Molly up front, but these are semi-rigid, uh, and so it stays in an open position where your mags go in, but they retain the mags when you're running, jumping, crawling, whatever you're doing. But the pouch remains open. Again, it's semi-rigid and it's really pretty strong. Uh, and then we have padding that goes on in the back and here on the sides. Mags just slip right in. Very easy to pull in and out. The Molly panel is actually Velcroed to each of these to just give it even more retention. Now, even though these pouches are sewn in, the front is Velcroed and then, of course, right here. But this actually opens up pretty good. Uh, you can slip some things down in here, but it's going to be pretty tight. But if you need paperwork, maps, things like that, you can slip them in. And then just seal it up and you've got it secure. He's using a very high tensile strength webbing. And then look at the quadruple stitching that's going on here. I mean, these are built to last. And, you know, one of the things that Robert does is a lot of competitive shooting, and he uses these rigs. He makes them for himself, and then he offers them for sale. So he knows that these are going to hold up to a lot of abuse, and he makes them that way. Then we have these side panels that kind of come out of the side with Molly webbing right here. Uh, it's part of the front here, and this is padded as well. It's going to give you a lot of uh, comfort, and you can add extra pouches or a med kit or whatever you want to here on the side. And then you can see the Duraflex buckles. This is part of your strap. And then you have your waist strap right here. And this is sewn in tight, very tight. Everything's well done. Here at the bottom, we have loops to be able to attach to your belt. Uh, and of course, this is adjustable. You could even attach this to one of his Infidel War Belts. Here is the mag pouch panel at the back. And you can see where this is all sewn in. And these are each padded. So it's going to be very comfortable to wear. And I'll tell you guys, you are not going to find this kind of quality with most companies. Now the shoulder straps are fully padded with closed foam padding. You have webbing here and here. Of course, you can, if you put a bladder on the back, a hydration bladder, uh, you can use those. And then we have the D-rings, which these are metal D-rings. Uh, the straps at the front, we have our 
quick release buckles, Duraflex buckles. They're large. Of course, you have your adjustable uh, straps here and here. And that's one of the things that Robert says is that these one size fits all. This will adjust out pretty large and pretty small. Here we have the box X stitching. Uh, look at the stitching right here. I mean, even though this is a very strong way to attach webbing uh, to your strap, uh, he's really reinforced these areas. And then it goes all the way up, and then all these areas here are stitched. The padded straps come down. We have a nice Velcro field right here. And then we have our standard webbing. Uh, this is very wide webbing. And of course, with your adjustable buckles, all the way down. And then we have a waist strap here at the bottom. And of course, you have your adjustment here. And the waist strap also has a Duraflex buckle to be able to attach that. And this goes around your waist, gets your chest, and then again, you can attach it to your belt. So it makes it very stable. Here you can see at the back, the webbing is attached with box X stitching. And then we have a lot of heavy stitching right here uh, underneath this Velcro. And underneath this pad is also the box X stitching as well. Not only can you fit the 30 rounds, or of course, these are 32 round magazines. Here are some 20 rounders, which were very popular at first, and they also fit, and the base is just right there. Now, they do get kind of low in there, but they will fit. Now, you also offer standalone pouches for either the Scorpion or the MPX, uh, and these have the clips at the back, so you can actually throw this on your belt, and uh, this is a great way to go, kind of incognito, um, and with the two or the singular, and of course with the clip, and this is actually a little shorter than on the chest rig, and so your mag fits right here, both 20 and 30 or 32 rounders. Now this is in the coyote color. It does come in a black, an OD, a ranger green, and a multicam. So there's a number of different choices, and you can go again to the usgruntgear.com website and check those out. I want to thank Freedom Munitions for supplying the ammo. Uh, you get a 5% discount using Suit00 at checkout. Check out these Manticore Arms magazines. Uh, these are great. They're at Prepper Gun Shop, and I'll have the link down below. And last but not least, this little Maglula for the uh, Scorpion is fantastic. I felt like if you're watching this video, you probably have or want a Scorpion. <laughs> so these are great things to have. I guys also tell you, man, the Scorpion is one of my favorite 9 millimeters. I mean, it's just fantastic. That's the way to go right there. Now we did quite a bit of testing with the chest rig, you know, just going out, using it, changing mags, uh, and just really getting a feel for it. Uh, one of the things I do want to note, and I'm sure we'll see it in the comments, is it was really hot that day, and I just, for some reason, didn't use the bolt release that's on the side of the rifle. <laughs> so if you're seeing that, uh, you know, that's just one of those little things. But aside from that, the chest rig just really worked fine fits well, it's comfortable even in the heat. But regardless guys, I'll tell you, getting the CZ EVO 3 out to the range is just a lot of fun. It is a very soft shooting rifle and with the 9mm it's cheaper to shoot than 5.56 and it's just a lot of fun. Uh, so I highly recommend the CZ EVO 3 and definitely pairs well with the US Grunt Gear Rapid Response chest rig. Now I mainly want to just show how it looks on. Uh, you can see the four mag pouches here and then on the side we have our molly. Uh, of course the straps. This is the way it fits in the back. It does come in an X harness and a Y harness configuration. Now you can choose. Uh, there's a number of different colors uh, and you can go to the usgruntgear.com website to check it out. This is in the Coyote and this is one of my favorites. You know Robert really uh, puts a lot of care into his stuff and uh, I know I've been on the phone with Robert uh, sometimes for hours talking about some of the ideas that he has and he just has a passion not only for law enforcement and military but also for civilians uh, one thing that uh, he said a number of years ago is he had sent some chest rigs over to Iraq and to Afghanistan to have them tested uh, by some of the guys over there and I just thought that was incredible 
again, being a former U.S. Marine, uh, he's just a top-notch guy. Now, this chest rig was actually made for the SIG MPX, which the magazines are just a little bit thicker right here. So these magazines will slide out really quickly and easily. Uh, with the MPX magazines, he had fully loaded magazines, turned the chest rig upside down, and it held the retention. Uh, with these, it's not quite as tight. In fact, I loaded some magazines and, and they just slipped. If you have one of the CZ Scorpions, uh, make a note of that when you get in touch with him, and I'm sure that he can do some adjustments uh, to give you just a little more retention for your CZ Evo mags. Of course, everything is fully adjustable, whether it's in the back or front, and again, he says one size fits all. So, whatever you need, he should be able to do it. If you maybe have some, you know, you're a larger person or you're a smaller person, you can get in touch with him, and uh, I'm sure that he can do any kind of adjustments that he needs to. The price of the single mag pouch with the clip is $19.95. It's $30.95 for the double. Now you can go to usgruntgear.com to find more information and see a lot of the other products that he has. One thing that is one of my all-time favorites is the Infidel War Belt. Um, a solid padded war belt that's just made just incredibly. There's a lot of different features that you can get on those and upgrade. Uh, whether it's Cobra buckles or you can go with the Duraflex buckles to save a little money. Uh, but it's, they're just really well made. And again, this shop is not one of these high production super machine shops. These guys make each and every piece and they do all the sewing by hand. I mean, it is just top notch. And for the prices that he offers for the work that he does, to me, is just phenomenal. Uh, this chest rig is $129 uh, on the U.S. Grunt Gear website. And if you need a chest rig for an AR-15 9mm, uh, whether it's Glock or Colt, he also makes chest rigs for those. He does make a lightweight chest rig with six pouches for like $99, which, guys, I'm telling you, for the quality you're getting, uh, you, you just can't beat it. And uh, it's just nice to be able to support a small business that's really doing things right. So check out U.S. Grunt Gear. Let Robert know I sent you. Now, one of the things that they do a lot, in fact, right now there's a big sale they're doing, and they're giving a, a nice percentage off. He runs a lot of different specials. Uh, because this video is going to continue after that special's over, uh, just go to that website and you can check out the different things that he offers. But one thing that I will guarantee you, because I know Robert very well, is you're going to love U.S. Grunt Gear. And no, he's not paying me. <laughs> and guys, with all the craziness that's going on right now, be smart, be good, and always do the right thing. Be strong, be of good courage. God bless America. Long live the Republic. See at the back the web. I don't think Freedom Munitions. Whoops. Now this chest rig again was specific. Now this chest. Now this chest rig was specific. All right. Right here. It's it's one of the specs.